I'm liking my own life. <laughs> oh, it's funny. Just waiting for people to come in. Takes a bit. Hi. Just waiting for my moderator to get in here, too. Marsha, Marsha, Marsha. Oh, my gosh. I haven't watched that show in a very long time. The Brady Bunch. Well, these lips. You know what? I can pull it off as a filter, but not in real life. It just doesn't look good. It's weird. <laughs> I look weird in red lipstick. I usually wear, um, like, pinks. Even this one might be a little dark. I don't know if you can see it. Probably not this light. Everybody's live already? That's okay. Because I just wanted to go live one more time. Because after today... Oh, I should have turned my comments off. Oof, hold on a minute. There we go. Because after today... There she is. Hey, Teresa. Today's the last day that I have to go live. And then after I do today, um, starting tomorrow, I can have an open panel. So that, that's what I really wanted. Absolutely wanted. Somebody's name that joined called McFart, or did I just miss something? I swear, I see McFart. Hey, Michelle. I swear, I see McFart. Okay, I don't know if any of you have heard this woman named um, Lisa Richards on TikTok. She is a um, how do you, uh, a rug, a b u. S-E-R. You can't say anything. Any, you know what I mean? I hate it. You've heard of her? So I started going the rabbit hole, going down the Lisa Richards rabbit hole. Uh, I think it was yesterday. Oh my gosh. I've never seen anything like that in my life. I was watching something on TikTok and then I don't know. I've seen her. I don't know. I've seen her somewhere. And then I seen on YouTube that this one creator, I can't remember her name. What is her name? But I started following her, and she posts everything that has to do with this Lisa woman. And, oh, I was just watching Lee that was mad at people for calling Animal Control and her son because he... You do. You haven't watched on purpose? Well, I don't watch her. I watched... The, I, I ended up watching YouTube and the creators that, um... Identifies as cat. What is wrong with people? So I've just wa been watching these creators who have been, um putting this on their channel. What is this one? Uh, it's called Frauditor Reaper. I like her. She's, <laughs> she ended up putting this video on YouTube and it was called Lisa got a week worth of groceries delivered. She needs nothing. Hey, good wives. I watch you too every now and then. They're exposing the good wives. They're good people. Should join their TikTok. So this woman, oh my God, how do you turn your phone around so you can watch it with me? Cause I don't want to be like this because then I can't see you or interact with you. Can you do that? Cause I need, I can't put anything on here. Hold on. What's more? Just turn this around. There we go. This is stupid. <laughs> so stupid but I guess I'm gonna have to sit at my computer and show you this the reason why I wanted to show you this because not only is this girl crazy 
and mean and does not need money for food. Sorry. I just wanted to show you these few parts here. Now, I did laugh a lot <laughs> just because there's this one part in here where she literally is freaking out. I know I'm making myself dizzy. I'm sorry. So Lisa's freaking out because she's starving. She says she's starving. She's, she's like dying. She's starving to death. As she's sucking on a popsicle, <laughs> this girl, <laughs> um, the Frauditor Reaper, this is her channel. She was um, laughing as well. Anyways, I'll shut up and I'll show you what I'm talking about. Come on. Just sucks I can't share on my screen. I obviously proved that I have the Venmo and I have the Cash App and I have the PayPal. So, that's it. I'm not calling this shit out anymore. Yeah, it is real fucked up because I already fucking had the money to eat. They want to get on here doing this shit. Then get off. Now they're sending pennies. Yeah. <laughs> Come back down because I'm blocking the fuck out of Deborah and Bailey, <laughs> bitch ass. Oh you want to send me a penny, you fucking bitch? Come on, get back in here, Maz. Abby, get in here. Deborah and Bailey, how dare you send those evil, evil pennies? You know that she is. So the, the, the woman that's talking right now, she's a creator. Definitely afraid of pennies. How dare you send her pennies? What's your name? Get in here. Get in here. Get these motherfuckers, bro. Come on. Whoa. What's her name? Get in here. That's her mod that she's speaking to. And, hey, uh, Charlie. Keep in mind she that does need help. This is insane. Lisa, you have to pay her money. I, Bailey and Zebra. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on, bitch. Wow. No, I don't want your fucking penny. <laughs> Shove it up your ass. Holy shit. You're not that sorry. You're not helping. Quit saying you're sorry. I could never do this. Who does this? I don't want your fucking sorry. It's just Katie. <laughs> you know what I was going to say? I was going to say, you watch. This is what, this is going to be KJ in the future. <laughs> sorry, I'm, I'm not shaking. I'm laughing. <laughs> I'll try and get to this popsicle part. It is, it's funny as hell. Get him. Get him. <laughs> so. Th oh, no. Oh, come Never on. Never fear a sudden accident or emergency again. <sighs> this new life safety device gives you the most advanced. The PP living life XO. So this girl goes on here every day and she's begging, absolutely begging for money. And she claims it's for her food. Well, she's been doing this for, from what I understand, three years. So people know it's not for food. People know what it's for. It's for rugs, you know? Well, you'll see. Just wait till I get to this popsicle part. You'll never eat a popsicle again. Sorry. What's the see Online scamming and lying to people. Um, it's like the only time she seems She's to getting to worse. Oh, with her boy. Kids, like... It's really sad. I missed. Like and share, like and share, like and share, like and share. The video is blurry. Sorry about that. Let's see. <laughs> I think we're, we're using the same filter. <laughs> Yes, please be forewarned that Lisa is happy Harley slobbering and snotting all over this popsicle for the next few moments. Um, you are more than welcome to skip past it if you would like. I kept it here because it is kind of relevant since she is screaming and yelling that she's starving to death <laughs> while sucking, slobbering, and snotting all over three popsicles. Oh, yeah, I gotta share it too. It is gross. You'll never eat yeah, a popsicle again. Protein. But it's just funny how she's screaming and yelling that she's starving, but she's eating popsicles. Oh, yeah. It is important to mention that this is after uh, this lady actually Instacarted Lisa a week's worth of groceries. That's where the popsicles came from. Me too. MGL, yeah. And she has a oh, yeah. week's worth of food now. 
but yet she's still on her begging for money to buy, quote-unquote, food. Just keep in mind that this is after the food came to her house, her apartment. Um, yeah. Some of them only followed that this page, so that's why I did that. Oh, holy shit. Wow. Thank I guess you. her main page was suspended. Oh, that's so gross. <laughs> yeah, I'm literally starving to death. Literally. <laughs> it's not a joke at all. I'm not joking. <laughs> to like, laugh but it is a little funny you gotta have new people come on to your life and try and convince and manipulate these people <laughs> that you're starving while you have a popsicle in your house <laughs> like she definitely did not think this one through at all like i'm so fucking hungry <laughs> yes yeah, so we can tell that you're hungry <laughs> and you sit there all over a popsicle like come on lisa Oh my God. <laughs> no, I didn't get to get anything. We came off with 12 cents. 12 cents. Oh my God, That's 12 cents. That's insane. Thank you for liking. Why did this pause? Pause, 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 pause. Am I planning on going live tomorrow? Yes, I absolutely am. I am going to go live tomorrow. And that is, I do have to go out though, so it'll be at night again. Um, but yeah, we'll go live tomorrow and you'll be my first panelist if you like, because this is my last day that I have to go live and then everything opens up. From what they're saying, my requirements is to go live three times in a, in a row. And I did. This is my third time. It's hot in here. Actually, I can show, I just wanted to show you this girl because it was just unbelievable what I was watching today, but I could show some Katie clips. I'll turn you around to me until I find something. There we go. Oh, yeah. That fell. Um, I know people wanted to watch the uh, Garrison Brown one that I did do because I forgot to post it. Sorry about that. I'm horrible. I forget everything. Oh, that's from two years ago. Oh, my God. Garrison, that was, that was a while ago. Okay. Um... I have a lot of videos, holy shit. I'm going to have to look through this. <laughs> this is going to take forever. Oh my gosh. Is that it? More people call her out? Let me see. Hey guys, I hope you're doing good. See, it's annoying listening oh to my, my God, did voice I though. Day. So my dumbass decided to make an appointment for... Um, three of them needed, so, oof, I had to get flea drops for 
But like the map carriers and bringing forth already had her flea drops. I don't want to watch they, my when video. They get grow into the pad. It's so sad. My cat get her. <laughs> so it gave me a break. <laughs> They're like, no worries. We'll make it another appointment. Our computers are down, so we can't even make an appointment. <laughs> oh, I'm out back. <laughs> I don't know Continuation. what the hell I'm talking about. Uh, Sorry. So this one says, good. I hope they win. You remember when she lied and decided to tell everyone that TLC and Cody were suing her? Yeah. So that was total clickbait, and I apologize for that because I didn't watch her video. It, the video was said that she was being sued by TLC and Cody Brown. Well, apparently at the end of her video, she was like, I'm not getting sued. Like, what a... Wow. Of course, total clickbait queen. So anyways, this person says good. I hope they win. Especially because all the family asked for when Garrison asked was respect and privacy. And you made video after video posting very personal information. Like screenshots of family text messages that that evening he passed. I understand anyone could request a copy of the police report. But doing it and posting all about it for views is another thing. You are tacky and have no regard for others. Well said, my friend. It's like a knife in the kidney. But in all seriousness, let the guy grieve in peace. The entire family needs time. And personally, I stopped watching her past few videos about the Browns because to me, it did feel like you were putting Garrison's death on Cody. Damn right she did. Sorry, that this one was proof. With McKelty. The police footage was video crossed the line. You made a fortune off this family. You're harassing a family during their time of grief. You're a YouTube blogger, not a reporter. You make more money than they do. You're a hypocrite. Have you heard the news? Katie Joy is being sued by Cody Brown and TLC, according to sources. Find out the exclusive details below. Yeah, the exclusive details that she lied. What lies are you spreading? Oh my gosh, please. This was the comments under her being sued. Nobody even believed her. Well, my dumbass did. I think we all did at first. <laughs> my yep. comment if you're only showing those that pay to be a member. Ooh. For those doubters, the AEB militia was, is illegal. Illegal. The purpose of the militia is to defend the cult from the government. Um, they believe they are sovereign citizens and do not believe they are required to follow the U.S. law. These men are actually... So this is bullshit. This is this one I'm reading here is all the proof that I'm going to... Not all of it. This is just a smidge of the shit that she did to that family. Hey, Freebird. Extremely dangerous, according to the reporting on the militia. They plan to blow up canyons, learned and prepared with explosive, and trained with a green beret from the army. These weapons that were illegal and untraceable. The weapons were illegally modified, according to the former member. Under the law, this militia was, is illegal, and would be considered domestic terrorism preliminary. Preliminary. Oh my god. That's who TLC has been promoting, folks. A cult that will be the next WACO. If this is true, why aren't you calling the police? Yeah, Katie. Huh? Hey, Mouth, why aren't you calling the police? <laughs> why are you not telling anyone who would listen that this is happening? Because that's a pretty serious accusation, and you should be calling and contacting your police department and getting in touch with the, the Arkansas police, actually, if this were true. But we all know you love to clickbait, and you love to lie. Thank you, Charlie. I'm sure your mother is very proud of the narcissistic <laughs> daughter you are. You and your husband shouldn't bite the hand that feeds you. Someday, your kids will probably watch the show and be embarrassed by you. Also, the women are Jenny! not because they are not married to more than one person. Only the men are. Mouse says, that's not true. It's Hi. because they are most often victims. Women can be charged for polygamy. How are they going to get charged for polygamy when they're not living in polygamy, moron? <laughs> Cody's married to one person, Robin. So stop it. <laughs> You're a little weird to be fair. <laughs> Oh, Our commercial, women. commercial, commercial. In providing online Sorry, I'm not um, rich enough. Their children. <laughs> to pay for the hey, premium diddle. so i just wanted to see what you were saying so katie is reacting to chauvin's verdict of course she is of course she is should we listen to her big fat mouth in the background and i'll just post this video later because i can if you guys want to i'll post this on my youtube it's on my youtube but i'll put it in the community section so that you guys can see it let me see It's hot in here. It's not, but I'm warm. Damn it, I should have used my laptop. Well, my son has my laptop, though.
What's the most dangerous? What's the most dangerous city in Canada? I can't lie to you, bro. It's gotta be the K Dubs, fam. How come? Bro, you go you go downtown, bro. You see the tents, fam. Full of fuck. <laughs> <laughs> The most dangerous city in Canada. The most dangerous city in Canada, I would say Toronto. Ha! You didn't block me on here, biatch. Something went wrong. Fuck, I'm blocked. <laughs> God damn. Oh, she's not live right now. Not live at all, unless... Oh, I'm not signed in. I don't know if that matters. That shouldn't matter, though, should it? No. Can someone see if she's live? Maybe she was live. I don't know. My God, she is obsessed with Gypsy. Thank you. <laughs> I know I got blocked the other day. I didn't even do anything. I didn't say anything. I was just watching for like five minutes. I'm just assuming she must have found out that... Um, I was on here. Search for me, maybe. She's not live right now. Ah, all right. I thought she was. I'm surprised she's not. No, she can't stay with long. Well, now what? She does want attention too much. I absolutely agree. I can't wait till I have people on. It'll be so much more exciting than just sitting here looking at me. It's like, yeah. I'll tell you how you how I really feel about her. <laughs> yeah, we have um everything's open though but yeah we have labor day you know what i thought so i was saying to everybody on tuesday tuesday i'll be able to go live on tiktok and i'm gonna have people on panel today's sunday i thought it was monday today <laughs> oh my god so yeah it's not even today's sunday so it is labor day tomorrow <sighs> yeah she's not live eh like the all the stores are open but they're gonna close early like when some of them are supposed to close at like six or even nine, they'll close around five. I don't know why I thought it was Monday. Yeah, tomorrow will seem like a Sunday. Your nail salon will be open. <laughs> so I got a message earlier uh, in my comment section. So this was funny because this person says the leading chin of Minnesota. It was ruined. <laughs> Oh my god. I can't get over that she still says that. Still. Like, they tried to ruin me. <laughs> she's still she's still saying it. Ruin? Ruining. How do you ruining? <laughs> I know it was you. I just didn't know if you wanted me to say your name. <laughs> oh, the Katie isms are just hilarious. Too bad I couldn't think of them all at once. I always forget. Yeah, so many words. Hey, crazy mom. I just, I'm trying to think. I know that there, there was the uh, rod iron. <laughs> and then, of course, she can't say ruin. She says ruined. <laughs> yeah, coast. Cost. I say words differently, too, myself. But, I mean, I don't say them wrong. I just say them weird. Um, like, about. <laughs> Apparently I say that wrong. <laughs> Not wrong, but weird. Yeah, wrought iron. It's wrought iron. I remember when she was live on her Instagram and her husband was, they were sitting in the living, she was sitting in her drinking chair and her husband was in the same room. I think he was watching the, like, the 
the game or something. Yeah, the Canadian accent. And um, she was talking about how she, about her 90s aesthetic, how she doesn't have one and was furious that someone claimed that she had a 90s aesthetic. So she's like, I don't like that type of stuff. I like wrought iron. He's like, wrought iron? She was like, whatever. I'm crabby today. Even my husband's gonna piss me off. I'm just like, holy shit, girl, calm down. Yes, that one. Oh my God, that was probably the best croaky. <laughs> Oh my god, and she still says it. She said it recently, and I can't remember what live it was. I don't remember what she was on, but she said it again. And I was like, no, it's karaoke. How do you fucking get croaky? I love wrought iron. I have a wrought iron darn. Oh, that would be beautiful. The only time I've ever seen her in a good... Oh, actually, I wouldn't even say good mood. I'd say normal. Is when she's getting money. When she's constantly getting the likes and she's constantly getting um, llamas or corgi butts. I remember that live. She was so mad about the 90s aesthetic and she thought lava lamps were the... Yeah, she was saying everything. Oh, she picked idiot. She's like, I know what the 90s aesthetic was. Oh, I grew up in the 90s. I was in school in the 90s. And she was trying to tell people that lava lamps and <laughs> the Calvin Klein underwear stuff things, remember? We're we're not from the seventies. It was from the nineties. And then she's like, I don't want to go. I don't want to re go back to my childhood. Oh, it was wow. She always has to be right. Bean bear, yeah, bean bag chairs, lava lamps, Calvin Klein crop tops, waif models. When she started covering the Duggars, she couldn't even pronounce their name. Yeah, remember she was calling them the Duggars. And she's like, the Duggars or the Duggars. Um, Whatever, you guys get mad at me when I say it wrong. Yeah, Lava Lamps came, made a comeback in the 90s. You're absolutely right. All that stuff came out in the 70s. A lot of people say that. And really, they say croaky? <laughs> I can't. I don't know how the hell they get croaky at a karaoke. <laughs> croaky. She does always say people's names wrong. Absolutely. They briefly had to come back in 2010. I'd love to get another lava. <laughs> Jinx, you owe me a beer. <laughs> I'd love to get another lava lamp. I really would. They were neat. I had a red one. Yeah, they were pretty neat. I didn't know they came back in 2010, though. I can say karaoke. I just can't spell it. I don't think I can spell it either. I can definitely say it, though. You think she says some names wrong on purpose? I wonder. I, it's just, to me, she's like, she acts like she's so smart. She writes these articles that she's, makes it seem like she's a journalist and she's a paid one at that. But we all know she's not. And she writes all these things on Instagram or Facebook, uh, even on TikTok. She'll write like this long article thing that she steals from people, like, in touch. <laughs> Um, and she'll put it on her own, whatever platform she's on and make it like it's her. She'll change a few rare, like words around, but she's taking it from other people's work and claiming it as her own and then says that she's a journalist. And it's, and she doesn't, no, and she doesn't proofread. She doesn't know how to spell and she doesn't even know how to pronounce half of what she's talking about. Even the way she says talking annoys me. No, she doesn't proofread. She does. She was just making fun of somebody who was not pronouncing something correctly. I'm not sure who she was talking about, but it. W she was saying that. And I'm like, are you serious? Have you read what you write? Have you seen what you write? Like, it's you can't pronounce shit. Like, the worst one is rune. <laughs> yeah, she says she doesn't make fun of people's looks while making fun of someone's looks. Exactly. And that's why I say that... Um, when someone does make fun of her looks, I don't care. I don't care. Um, <laughs> yeah. Pro Hack Vice? No, bitch. Pro Hack VJ. I remember that. That was hilarious. When that person told her on panel that it was Pro Hack VJ, she's like, are you a lawyer? And literally had to go look it up on Google just to prove her wrong. And she wasn't wrong. If you ever want YouTube without ads in the middle of the videos, download Video Light in the App Store. Really? Well, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. 
There was a lot of them. Katie isms. At least on Trailer Park Boys, you guys know Ricky. At least Ricky isms are funny. <laughs> you know how you say, oh, it's just a piece of cake. Ricky's like, it's just peach and cake. It's like, no, it's not. <laughs> oh, Trailer Park Boys. They're funny. Video light. I'm gonna remind me, Teresa, because you know me, I'll forget. I'm like, what was it called? No, it's not. <laughs> Do you guys ever watch Trailer Park Boys? Oh my god, probably my favorite episode would have to be the Conky episodes. My son and I were in Giant Tiger the other day. Oh yeah, you guys don't have one. So it's like a, I don't know, it's like a small, well no, it's like a Walmart actually. They sell groceries and they've got clothing, so it is like a Walmart. And, um... Reminded me of when we were in Giant Tiger, we were walking by the chip aisle, and I'm going to show you. Sure enough, we're walking by it, and I see that, hold on, i got to show you. I see that there are chips now, Cherry Park Boy chips, and it's called the Dirty Burger. <laughs> and they taste like burgers, they're amazing. They taste so good, yeah, so here they are. The Dirty Burger, Trailer Park Boys, and it even says in the corner, what is it? Scrump Dilly from Conky. <laughs> so they've got Dirty Burger. You know that guy, Phil, with the gut? Yeah, I've seen the wrapper chips before. I never tried them, but the Trailer Park Boys ones are amazing. The other one, that I've tried the burger ones. They taste like burgers, like cheeseburgers. They're so good. And then, um, yeah, it's neat, right? They have another one, too. Your friend looks like bubbles. Aww. There's another one uh, that we really like. Because you know how Ricky's always talking about, um, what, chicken chips? What are they called, chicken chips? Yeah, chicken chips. But I don't know if they were called chicken chips, but they were chicken chips. But I can't remember what the hell the name of it was. Um. So anyways, those chips are freaking great. So it was chicken chips? Okay, so those are, yeah, hit the chips that he eats on the show. They've made it into Trailer Park Boys chips. So there's the, the dirty burger with Phil with the big gut and every time he just burps. <laughs> You don't know anything about these chips? I don't know. Maybe they're just Canadian. Because the boys are Canadian. I don't know. There's the chicken chips. Rabbit! Yeah, tap -dee tap 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 Get me up to a million. Send me a corky bum. <laughs> and they got, um, you know, all dressed chips? They call them dressed all over. <laughs> um, what was the other one? There was ketchup. I can't remember the, how, what they call the ketchup ones. You're getting carpal tunnel. <laughs> it's weird how you can do it yourself though. Here, I'll help. We're going for 1500. That's the best we can do. Well, I don't want anybody to get carpal tunnel. Yeah, dressed all over and there was a, I think it was called instead of ketchup chips, it was like ketchup, uh, fries and ketchup. Dressed all over. The Dirty Burger, and Chicken Chips. And there was a Dill Pickle. I think that was it. I think that was it. You're gonna sacrifice your wrist? Hey, Judy! So tomorrow I can go live, and I can have people on panel, so I'll be happy to have you on, Judy. And then I'm gonna have Charlie on as well. Hopefully you don't have to, I only have to have, or hopefully I can have more than one at a time. I love Dill Pickles too. When I was pregnant, Oh my god, that's all I ate was pickles, 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 pickles. Yeah, it will be fun. At least I'm, you know what I mean? Because I feel it's lonely. <laughs> I like to have people on panel. Do pickle chips. They have these pickles called, um, I bought them. Hey, the nibbler. I can't remember what they are called. Sonic dope fries. No, I don't have a Sonic. I've always wanted to try it. I want to try Sonics. I heard like their milkshakes, everything is just great. But they have these um, these dill pickles. They're they're sliced, and they're in 
Oh, it's KJ's eyebrow blindness. Blindness, yay! I love that name. Um, these dill pickles they have, they're, they're sliced and they're in like a little bag. And it's called Dilly Pickles. And I was like, okay, we have to get them. My cat's name is Dilly. So I grabbed, so I grabbed them every time we're out. They're like $1.99. And it's like a pouch of them. They're so good. They've become our favorite pickles. And it's cute because it says Dilly right on it. And that's my cat's name. You buy bags of ice from Sonic? Their food's awful. I think they have like these amazing cheese fries or something. And their milkshakes apparently were they're, they're, like really good. Oh. Huh. They have great ice. <laughs> good to know if I ever go to the States, stay the hell away from Sonic. My son, he keeps like he's always on YouTube and stuff. And he's always seeing all the great things that you guys have in the States that we don't have. They have the best onion rings. Okay. Oh, now I'm hungry. Chili cheese dogs, onion rings. I like A&W's onion rings, but I would definitely try um, Sonic's. Depends. What is he? I can't remember. Um. He's been wanting to try these restaurants. You like the onion rings too? Thank you for the, the badges. What are boardwalk fries? They have them at Sonic? Who joined my team? I didn't get to see. Welcome. I don't know what we do when we're on a team. I have no clue, but thank you. Sonic puts a touch of vanilla. You sent me cloud bread? Good, I was hungry. Hey, Mrs. Nobody. I see you. I see you. So I can have people on panel tomorrow, Miss Nobody. So it'll be great. I'll be able to have people on panel and then we can actually have a topic and I'd love people to come up and tell their stories. Yay, you joined my team. I don't know. How do you guys join a team? What do you do? Yeah, I think panels will be fun. It will make it more interesting and there'll be a lot more like... A lot more things to talk about than just me trying to think of topics or literally going off about the trailer park boys. You've never been live? Okay. Oh, I love cheese curd. I used to eat, so that was my thing was pickles when I was pregnant with my son. Since then, thank you for the ice cream cone. I love anything dill pickle. So this is my, I don't know, I'm obsessed with these. Dill pickle, <laughs> sunflower seeds, and then I decided I was gonna try these pumpkins, dill pickle pumpkin seeds. They're really good, but they're really addicting. Really addicting. I would love you to join. Yeah. Your kids have been the kids have been camping. I don't know what time I'm gonna go live tomorrow. I do. I go at night. Yeah, I just find it easier because me and my son are usually busy during the day and we hang out and that's when I get like any cleaning, cooking, whatever done, right? Yeah, I'd love you to try. I should do what thing? <laughs> no, I don't want to act like a robot and eat an ice cream cone. I look like a... I probably would look like an idiot. Yes, I'm in Canada. I've never left Canada. I've been to Quebec City before. It was beautiful. They have all cobblestone roads. Like, oh, it's beautiful. That's what people like. <laughs> Thank you for the ice cream cones. So question, what do I do with... um? TikTok coins. I have someone from Australia in here. Well, hello. Alrighty. Yes, I agree. I think it does help keep me safe. It keeps me safe from a lot of things that's been going on around these YouTube streets lately. That's pretty disgusting, if you ask me. It's not just KJ, it's others. Yeah, I'm confused by it too. Hi, you're from New Zealand? Hi. Just watch Becca Scoop's new video, good or bad, that she didn't mention her friend. I'll have to watch. Yeah, I know there's these um, TikTok coins, so I was looking and I think, wait, you can exchange them to give gifts to other, other people or I think people use it as a payout. 
Oh, cool. Thank you. Because I was looking up, um, looking up, like, wh what things, like, what are these things cost? And a lot of them are, like, a one cent or two cent. Some of them are even, like, five or ten dollars. They're these stickers or whatever that you shoot out, right? Um, so I was just looking to see what, what was what. And then, and then I it starts saying like in order to actually make money on here, it's it's really 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 hard. You have to get sponsors. They said TikTok has so much going on with gifts and teams. I find it overwhelming. Yeah, that's probably why I didn't want to give her attention. Yeah. Hi, Shell. Is it true I can't vape on here either? Hold on. Yeah, the sponsors. I'm not sure what kind of sponsors. I don't know if you get to pick them or if they pick you. I don't know. You're not allowed? Okay, I won't. Hi, Jennifer. Yeah, it's a lot to figure out what to do in here. I don't know. I just want to have fun. But the main thing is, I want to warn people about KJ. Yeah, someone said TikTok doesn't like when people smoke. Okay. And that one person just said it there too. You sent a GG. What's a GG? You sent a TikTok. Thank you. Oh, you joined my team? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You like my videos? Thank you. I don't know, I just came over here just so I can have people on panel and we can discuss what the real issue is and get it out in the open because right now, Katie has the floor. Nobody knows what she's like over here at all. This is all new people and from what I've seen, her audience is very young, very young. So they are looking up to her, unfortunately. You're going to have to do it off camera. TikTok doesn't like certain words either. TikTok sounds like a pain in the ass. Thank you, Abbott. Yeah, they will learn, unfortunately. Like that one woman, um, yeah, definitely corrupting. Thank you, I'd love your help. She will turn on them soon, absolutely. Yeah, does watch everything I do. She was all proper, yes, and she was like, don't swear. I don't swear on here. I don't like swearing on here. And now she's dropping F-bombs left, right, and center. I mean, she does, and she's rude and just blocking people for telling her that, not even necessarily that she's wrong, but they have read and researched or they've been told like somebody by somebody that this, in fact, is true. They did the research and she dropped them the other night. I'm just like, wow. It literally, it's like, God forbid you prove that woman wrong. She does cuss like a sailor. I know I do too, but she puts on this facade that she's so innocent. And the woman is a fucking monster. Yeah, she does mirror anyone. Anyone she comes into contact with. It's scary. It's single white female, big time. I am doing good well. Doing good well. Yeah, I'm doing good well. If you are too. <laughs> I don't care if others do it either. I've always had a potty mouth, always. It's just, ugh, my family's bad for that. The drunker she gets, the more she cusses and repeats herself. Yeah, she does. She does. What is on my phone? You like that too? Okay, good. Um, there was a couple, well, not a whole, there's about two people, two different people that ever said to me on my YouTube channel, they've said, you know, um, I do enjoy your videos, but your mouth. <laughs> I'm like, I, I you know, I, I apologize. I can't change who I am. I can try to not say swear words as much, especially the F-bomb. I could try not to, but when I'm mad, all bets are off. It's a fuck storm. <laughs> Oh, that pissed me off the other night, too, saying she worked for Habitat for Humanity. Are you serious? Next, she's going to tell me she's a freaking gynecologist. 
This girl, Katie, thinks she's done everything. Did you, yeah, Sir Morbid was talking about her. The whole panel was. It was great. It was great, actually. It's like, finally, finally. <laughs> gyno, I know. I'm just trying to think of something, anything. Because I guarantee you, she would definitely be like, yeah, I was a gyno once before I, went, before I got my Spanish degree. I was a gynecologist, guys. <laughs> She said she worked for Habitat for Humanity. Absolutely she did. It was the night that she was on TikTok Live and she was talking to that cats and crochet, the older lady that she was ripping apart, the whole chat was ripping her apart. That's when she was mouthed about it, saying, I work for them, I know what they do. I've done, built houses for them. Like, fuck you have. No, I'm so sick of her lying. We did it, we did it. Yeah, she did say that. She said she put up drywall. She's like, do you realize what it takes to put up drywall? Girl, I was putting up drywall when I was like seven, eight, nine, ten. How I learned is we moved into a really shitty house, really shitty house. It literally had to be built from like the inside, <laughs> like the inside had to be all repaired. Some of it was livable, but most of the bedrooms weren't. So a lot of us kids were sleeping in the living room and stuff. So I learned how to do drywall by watching. And I like, obviously I had to have help because I was just a kid, but I would nail I would put, I would hammer the nails in. I would help hold it up. I learned, I learned how to do mudding and everything. Ugh. That's what I'm going over tonight. Thanks for reminding me. I have that video of her talking about how you can't get a UTI from doing the hanky bank. <laughs> Cause you know, it's two different holes. I've looked under a dress before I got my Spanish water degree. <laughs> yes, thank you. Remodel. See, I'm not going to get mad and block you. <laughs> That's exactly what the word I was looking for, and I couldn't figure it out. I couldn't think of it. You wish you know how to do that stuff? It's not that hard. It really, I, well, now that we have YouTube, back then we didn't, but now that we do, you could do it pretty quickly. You just have to have someone to help you hold it up. And then once you get the, the top nails in, then it's good to go. And mudding is so easy with the tape and the screen, if there's a hole, whatever. Although I haven't done this since I was a kid, I'm sure I can figure it out. <laughs> okay guys drop it she did and then she got so angry she's like okay i got it i'm wrong seriously you guys don't get stuck on what we're talking not what we're talking about <laughs> girl you were talking about not getting utis from sex because they're from two different holes that's what you're talking about no i ain't gonna block and dox you hell no Miss riding four wheelers in the mud. I guess it's different meaning in the south. I never did that. I was terrified. I was such a girl. I would not get on four wheelers or snowmobiles. Snowmobiles where I, I used like where I grew up and it was a really small town. Smaller than this. I had nothing. That's what we did in the winter. Thank you that you love my comment. Thank you. It is crazy how she can act with people. That's exactly why I wanted to come on here. It's so that people I don't know, even if you don't like me, just <laughs> I have a shirt that says you want to fight Luca. <laughs> but at least if people come on here, you know what? They can think I'm a big goofball, whatever. Think I'm a liar. Think whatever they want. As long as you hear me, that gets stuck in your head, maybe. That's my hope. And I'm hoping that it helps people because she's dangerous. Absolutely dangerous. I'll never forget that. You want to fight Luca? Fuck off, Lizzie. Why don't you just fuck off? <laughs> Oh, she's great. She's grand, ain't she? Uh, and just think, she's been doing all this crap for years. It all started with that mommy group. That mommy group on Facebook. I had a shower before I got on here. And because I've been sweating, my hair's starting to go a little... Ooh. I'm not sure if she had a live tonight, actually. Is she even worse on TikTok? She was horrible on Instagram and she's getting right up there again on TikTok, yes. I don't know how she can thrive on it. I really don't. What did you get? You sent Gimme the what? Gimme the boat. You sent me Gimme the boat. I don't know what that is, but thank you. 
she's getting like how she is on Instagram when she was drinking all the time and she was a complete dick. She's getting that way on TikTok as well. She's rude. She's dropping people. She's accusing them of lying. She won't even let them talk. When someone comes up and tries to explain to her that they are, say if it's a lawyer, uh, a doctor, an actual reporter, someone who's done their research, they'll try and explain to Katie in the nicest way possible that in fact, no, in fact, you are you're wrong, this did happen or this didn't happen, and she'll drop them right away because God forbid she's proven wrong. It's sickening. You're speaking random things. Absolutely, chicken, absolutely. Did you guys see the video I did? Was it yesterday? With the photo of the lines on the glass table or was it a mirror? I think it might've been a mirror. Plus, we can never, ever, ever forget it's weird. I have a Q-tip here. It's for my dog's ears, but <laughs> this, oh, look, you can see my fake lips. But anyways, this with the powder on it. Yeah, I'll never forget that. Yeah, Q-tip. I just want... I don't know. I want people to be safe. I want people to... I just... Sorry, I'm not even finishing a sentence. I'm just... It's overwhelming, the stuff that she's done. And I just want people to be aware. And the... I know there's a lot of us aware, but it still surprises me that there's still people, like on this platform, on TikTok, that just don't know. It just amazes me. They do find out quick, though. Almost as bad as Amber Heard doing it on the stage. Yes, exactly. <laughs> Shut up, Terry. <laughs> I do. I want people to be safe. I want them to be aware. I want them to be careful because you don't know what you're up against when it comes with her. If you piss her off, you're going to get doxxed. Do, like, does anybody want that? No. She sucks. Thousands of people. Really good people that didn't deserve it. Nobody deserves it anyways. It's horrible what she does to people. The bullying, the harassment, everything. The stalking. No, it's needed. Even when I thought I knew about KJ, I didn't really know what she was getting. No, it is bad. She's live. Are you serious? She's live? All right, let's see what this bastard's talking about. <sighs> she just went live. Of course she did. I wonder, yep, yeah, she is. I wonder if her, um to Ray Shadow, her fellow lap dogs up there, or Camille. You know, I normally I'd be like, I feel sorry for them. I don't. I really don't. You're not blocked yet. Yeah, she does keep going live right after me. Oh, fuck off. You know what it's called? Brie pops off about my kid. Here we go. Bull, 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 bull. What happened? Or did I just get blocked? Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> I think I might have just got blocked again. You're blocked there too. I don't know what's going on. Hold on. It's because of this. It's because of what they're doing to other creators. Because I knew as soon as I came out, they were going to go for my... Okay, it's her TikTok. Ha! Someone says, I feel people dislike you, Katie, because you can handle stuff pretty calmly. You guys don't know KJ at all. Maybe this won't work on my computer. That's weird. I have a very old computer. Victim, victim, victim. Absolutely. Fighting and acting like trash. I'm not even um, signed in. And the stuff that comes with it. And it's like causing them to lash out at each other. 
Yeah. Ray shadows there, face there, Camille's there. And, and it, well, I mean, I'll, I'll be clear. Like they've been creating this chaos the whole time. Like this bull. is literally what. Can you guys hear it? Um, this is what they've done. Like Christy digs up information on people. <sighs> she finds out their records. She gets their addresses. She gets their phone numbers. If she knows how to get back at someone she'll do it and i even had this i even scolded her wow about she out. just talked she about herself Nina and her kids and talking about her custody case with her ex-husband and i was like christy what are you doing why are you talking about her parenting like leave her alone she's not a murderer Jeez. like your stepdaughter she does but they feel like if they can deflect <laughs> and put it on you and make you look bad you'll stop talking about the fact that I think Gypsy I'm allowed to as long as I'm not showing it felony for murder How long is she going to keep going oh on gosh, about this There's people in here I don't know Oh don't you know. poor baby okay, I'm watching Bina Bina wants to come on and Ashley Reina You should let me okay, come on Katie I think I'd love to one. Request to join the box. Put a one in the chat so I can set you, please. She took that from Fancy. I thought so. I knew it. So Christy has been someone that knows me, knows everything that's going on. Um, Here with we go. My child, and so for them to use the child against me is just disgusting because she knows me. Why would she give a shit after what you've done to the family, you fuck? Honestly. Oh, I'd I never last up there. I people that were friends with them reach out to me and share and like, they've had similar experiences. It's just, they want everyone oh. to, and that no Hannah girl's back in the do, audience. No matter what they do, just so She's you know, claiming that, that um, change the fact her title is brie pops off about my kid like that can never be expunged wow you know what they're trying to say right now do you know literally what the pr is trying to spin right now they're literally trying to spin that the reason why CaseNet took down gypsy's case is because four content creators are under investigation which is hysterical because that would have nothing to do with gypsy's criminal case her criminal case would not come down because content creators are talking about her. She doesn't online. take care of her kid. Todd does. That's fucking but proof. This is, no, She's it, online it, 18 okay. hours a day. Ashley, Raina, we are not justice for Nick here either. Like, at all. I just want to be clear here. Like, Now she's not, not justice, justice for, Nick. for Nick. Nick has his wow. sentence. He she is trying to make herself relevant. He and Gypsy. Gypsy, frankly, should be in prison along with Nick. We are pro sending Dipsy back to jail. Yes. Thanks, we are Lawrence. Not pro Nicholas go to John. Like, I feel like people like absolutely they uses forget about what Nick did, and they just they hate Gypsy so much that they forget what he did. Girl, you need to give this shit up. This is boring. It's boring as hell. She did say she never wanted to be a mom. Absolutely. Oh. Never, ever oh, wanted to be a mom. She was only a mom because that was the I deal between her and Todd out. so that Todd would marry her. That's from her mouth. Okay, Susan. Yes, ma'am. I want to ask you a question. There's this oh. whole thing about, I've been hearing about the Bayou. And yes. how there's this like whole culture of like retaliation and like fighting. She does know Robin, yeah. And like. No, she doesn't like kids. She never wanted kids. Getting back at people. That's sick. Is that a thing? Mother's Day and her son's birthday are the worst days of the year. I of, don't know. Yeah, that, of the year for her. That would be 100% accurate. I You've know seen that, Robin? That That's horrible. To some She's degree. Horrible. Um, she does want her to go back to jail, but, but you can't put someone back in prison sure, just because you want that. I, I can't say. I just can't I don't say. like gyps either, but the woman's um, not doing that anything I know wrong. That are, from, that are from cut off in that area. Um, this woman's new. Don't have that kind of mentality. Susan Love, her name is. But they're also not originally from there, so. Yep, I can't contribute to that. Exactly. One. 
Kelsey said that's more of a mentality in New, New Orleans. She's from New Orleans. 100%. I can, I can <laughs> state that as a fact. They do um, yell at him. You know, if it's bled over to the... I you absolutely know, agree. I think... Yeah, she did contact the parole officer. I made a video yesterday about that. that mentality. Who does that? You go. I read the whole Depending on letter. What crowd you're in. Does that make sense? Yeah, I'm from Minnesota. You think so, Rabbit? So we, Can you imagine? Honestly, I wouldn't doubt it. Never, I would not doubt it. We'll talk shit, but we're not going to, like, retaliate like that. Yeah. Bullshit! Exactly. Bull. Yeah, Ivory Grows Wild. Ivory Rose Grows Wild came up on my panel one night, and she's down from the Bible. She always she yells. That that's not uncommon down there. So do I when it comes to her. Um, <laughs> Sorry. She, she said there's a lot of, I mean, she said the culture, there's a lot of guys that are working out on the rigs or fishing. Yeah. yeah. Women are gone or women are taking home care of them. Yeah. Home by themselves. When dads are home, there can be a lot Nobody's of Nobody's even talking in her life in the I comments. Mean, yeah. I mean, I, I'm, again, um, it wouldn't surprise me. Someone just told her enough already in the chat. Of the culture in the bayou, but I, you know, I can't state for fact that that's something that happens. And the people that I know that live in Cutoff. Yeah, she's now a bayou expert, guys. <laughs> Christy was always like, I'm going to go kick that bitch's ass. Like, that was like her favorite thing to say. That's new, right? Not surprising. You know, I grew up in the in the hills of Tennessee. We used to say that all the time, too. And half the time, back in the day, that would be something that we, we would retaliate, you know, when we were younger. But then you grow up. Maybe some people she's just don't grow up. She's an expert. <laughs> I don't think she's grown up because she... Big joke. Well, clearly, if she's still saying things... Where have I seen your name before, gone, Robin? You know? Why do I know this woman's name? I've seen it. Must have seen it on TikTok Christy's somewhere. Christy's fighting anyone. That's bullshit. <laughs> That's all Christy does. Like, Christy, I have so many text messages I could literally show you of Christy. It is a lot of people's saying, favorite thing to okay, say. Bitch. I'm going to go. There was close to 400. I'm going to go kick that bitch's There's ass. There's 492 like, now. I can't wait to watch that bitch fall. Like, <laughs> Probably. Just just yeah. Really, I don't know. There's her friend Vicky, who is from Mississippi. She's like. She knows everything, I guys. I to drive up to, uh, to Kentucky and. Kick Can I picture KG in the ring? Okay. <laughs> uh, Very aggressive, yeah. They literally want to hurt the people that don't like Gypsy, and it's like... Girl! I don't know, part of it's like... Their own pride. No, she's not passive-aggressive at all. Their own guilt. I mean, I can't imagine standing up for somebody... That is not what Gypsy has done. Christy's not what in her 60s. That? She's in her 50s. She's 53. Sorry. She knows everything, guys. Yeah, I, I just... I, I can't She literally had someone stalking Brie while she was walking her dog. But I know. I saw I that. That was ridiculous. I mean, she's there's just, there's not just all there. She's crazy. The, the woman needs to be put in prison, if you ask me. City in every state. No, they know nothing about her. It's just... Yeah, KJ Haley, did. You don't Rabbit. Know Christy. So get out of my chat. Leave. You clearly don't know her either, Katie. You think you do. Anyone that you says don't. That Christy doesn't say that shit and is all talk. Y'all don't know her. Y'all. Y'all. Huh? Oh, I was going to say, I think you can look at Christy and see what type of person she is. She's She doesn't just have a, a you know, an RBF. She, you can tell that that's who she is. Well, you guys are fucking stupid because you can't look at KJ and see that she's a monster. Uh, life after lockup today, and I—I I don't know how she can keep her platform. I don't. She needs again, to be reported constantly. By how she was acting about how I haven't either. Responsibility to meddle in Gypsy's relationship. Absolutely, and Robin. And get Ryan <laughs> place so the block. Can exactly. She can't control Ryan. Um, which is what it comes down to. It's all same about shit for every day. And I was thinking about how. I actually wanted Damn to have this live Christy come up on my panel, get in the box because I'm kind of getting sick of her using Brie to yell at me. Yes. Like, sun's Christy, sun's out. Yes. Yeah. Get on my fucking panel. And those lip holes. I need to know. Right. Be, like, about it. be a woman about it. Mm -hmm. Stop using your flying monkeys. What? Get your ass up here. <laughs> 
Say it to my face. Girl, Let's I'd love to, but you face. won't let me. You're a you're a pussy. Yeah. Yeah. And Christy no, this owes is you not nothing. What I dedicate my whole life to Karen Randall, and I'm going to block you. What the I fuck did Randall do? Thank you. Okay. I mean, I would literally, dude, Christy, I'll pay you five hundred dollars to get in my box. Ew. Since you're all about the cash, you need a thousand. What about five? Like you have the money. <laughs> she doesn't even have the money. Oh, wait, back up. Back the truck up. What? What? Dr. Oz was going to pay her. Yeah, Dr. Oz was going to pay her $5,000. Oh. Ooh. Was he really? I would have loved to say that. Get in her box? It just doesn't sound right. She's a millionaire, you're right. And you blocked me. Uh, I think you misunderstood me. That's that Ray girl Christine talking, that Ray shadow, who's got the picture of Gypsy either. with the red hair. I don't know how I cannot stand her. that woman. I can't wait till they have a fallout. I've heard that. You can only well, block 10K on chat. TikTok. Yeah. Blocked. Well, it's like her main page. So if someone oh. in your world Exactly. Me, Gypsy and Christy are enjoying themselves on their cabin trip while Katie's on a live bitching about them. And then she doesn't get notified on her main page whenever Katie's live. So that's kind of what I think she's saying. Could you sock Katie's boob any harder? Like, wow. She literally only, so what I can tell you about, like, here's, here's, here's a story I can share with you about Christy. Oh, for fuck's sakes. I Here we go, guys. Bones, like, I know where all the bones are buried. I know where shit is. Like, this is why she's mad about the act. Okay. Come on, spell Michelle it, liar. Dean, I think that's her name. I she bet we've heard this. Mommy Dad and Dearest. She wrote an article for BuzzFeed, and then they decided to do an adaptation of Gypsy's Life for Hulu. Initially, they, as she was writing, she the does make this shit the up. Show, and she's they already mentioned were this. Working with the family, however, <laughs> oh, for the for network us. did not want the the family to be overly involved in it because they didn't want it's the same their shit. narrative to be the narrative, right? Like they that's your story. Be that's her story. Influenced. They wanted it to be unbiased, basically. Like they knew that they were going to add stuff that was dramatized. They knew stuff would be not totally to the truth, but it would be true. Thank you for joining my team. That it would be close right well, recognizing that they had to <laughs> don't worry you family. won't get a uti there <laughs> and but they didn't want to work with the blanchards because they couldn't trust the blanchards wouldn't try to influence and make it a sympathetic story to gypsy they wanted it to just be a story right with she can times. she's literally sitting on a live just As talking crap be. saying whatever right. she wants As and these one two four idiots are like know. tell me more Tell me more, Sensei. And you are wonderful. Like that. I hope you did. Thank you if you did. Pretty accurate. They didn't have a lot of stuff that wasn't accurate. They definitely added stuff, right? But I actually really liked no. the act. Did you guys they ever watch like it? The act because it she doesn't make sense. Gypsy for being the manipulator that she is. Really, they don't. Katie like said the act because it shows <laughs> Nick as. Sorry, it's hard to talk with her talking. The autistic young man that he was. Meanwhile, Katie went on a rampage That's telling anyone who would like listen it. that the act was wrong, they got it wrong, it was all lies. Their narrative depends on Nick being the evil boogeyman. And I'm not saying Nick is, an, is a perfect person. And they don't like Exactly. That. And from my understanding, they did actually have were able to help on the show the I act from what i understand i'd have to really make sure but i'm pretty sure they had some input on that they take i think what they <laughs> was, was, and you can go read go find interviews with the production of hulu they'll speak better to how yep. they developed it, the story but they tried to stay as exactly close to the story you as can't possible. lie she, real uh, life situations and they had to create stories about fancy it's funner to listen to absolutely and we've already heard all this crap the katie's been what their Obviously, bff for five years have, you know dialogue 
for Gypsy's conversations. I agree. She should go on stand in the corner with Gothica. That's what she's doing. Do, do you not think that they made Dee Dee look maybe a little bit worse than what she was, though? I honestly don't know because... Yeah. But you know everything, it's right? It's hard to know with that because... As I've been watching a lot of these documentaries, a lot of the depictions of Dee Dee have relied heavily on Gypsies. No, you don't save that. Absolutely not save five messages. Five five years worth of messages. Those That's that insane. That tells me that she was just itching to get in a fight with them so right? she could she right. could show all these messages. And it's hard when That's you're sick. angry to be objective. Um, Susan, right now it's Katie, but before that was Susan Love. Her. She's new. Do I think that Dee Dee was evil? I mean, yes. Yeah, I don't yeah. think any mother I agree, chicken. is kind that forces their child to sit in a wheelchair. Oh, whoa, whoa. So that she can, you know, steal from hey, her profits and mm -hmm. charities. Of course not. Are you fucking kidding me, Katie? I think anyone that discounts the abuse. Katie's done this to her own son. Abuse, and even some of the physical abuse that Gypsy had to go through. I mean, shaving your head and making her pretend she had cancer. Mm -hmm. Try yeah. to be a She's really teenage on there. girl and you have to have your head shaved so your right. mom can con the community. Try being a fucking child that's well, what and, and just pushing that, 12 really who's not allowed out of the too. house because his lazy right. his lazy because mother wants to sit community. online right. 24 hours a day. That's not exactly. cool. <laughs> that kid has no life. I feel and so I, bad for but him. But I think like the biggest thing that I've noticed in all of it is that I always go back to like Dan Patterson's press release that he did when the plea deal went out was that he said I agree. The homicide she probably is mad that she didn't fake it first. Or, Seriously, she's that um, sick. KJ's like, reading comments. You basically said that, like, no matter what Gypsy went through, what happened to Dee Dee wasn't justified. This exactly. wasn't the defense. Oh, okay. it's over and over of the same crap. And I think some people, when they're looking at the story, it's like people want to tie this up and to have a perfect villain and a perfect victim. And they want everything to be like this. Like, meanwhile, Katie hasn't shut the hell like, up about they this want it to be like, since Gypsy's um, been released. It's even worse now that they want nothing Antonia, to do with her. What's her name? Um, who killed her pimp? Um, in that in that situation, you can be like, of course, of course, he deserved to die, right? Or she killed someone, right? Like, so you're like, yes, in that situation, Centoya Brown, right? Where yeah. you're like, she's a, a victim that you can get around and get behind and be like, yes, I support you. What the fuck is she, she talking about? Being in that life is not, you needed to. And she was under threat, right? Why and is she, I don't understand. The, the medical... I can't believe they're listening either. Um, I really can't. Stuff that the fraud that they had been doing stopped years before. Yeah, it doesn't make any sense. Okay, I'm glad I'm not the only one. I don't understand. Like seven years before, didn't it? No. Three seven years. years before. Three years. That's Three Susan years, yeah. talking again. It had been many years since she'd had a procedure. Yeah, crooked. Yes. Yeah. Many years since she'd had any kind of surgery. And most of the surgeries she had when no. she was very young. Yeah. Everybody else was muted. Gypsy did not live a life of luxury. That's bullshit. That house was a thousand square feet. They they had a lot of gifts, but she didn't have a life of luxury. Clearly she did. She went to Disney. She had the fuck. I think she didn't have a life of luxury, but I do think that she that had it made a with a lot of things that she got in her life. However, I do not believe the, that her childhood but was amazing. Even if Gypsy. Even if yes, Dee she is the real life Dee. I've been saying that for a long time. That doesn't yeah. justify Dee Dee's death. Oh, absolutely not. Very jealous they weren't woman. given a car. They bought the car. Okay. Here she goes she getting pissed. She just put five thousand dollars on a car down. Like she doesn't oh, fucking know everything, and I'm sick of no. this know-it-all. Oh, okay. Like I wish she would let me up, I didn't but I know once I request, I'll be blocked. Wasn't given to them. Now, there's a process you have to go through for that, isn't there? For yes. Habitat. 
And, and yeah, she got more than most kids. Payment. They do, and they have to have a monthly payment. They have a mortgage. They have a. It's the more I look into Habitat, I'm like the more of a fraud charity that is. Um, okay. <laughs> now it's, right Habitat now, remains a fraud know. now, guys. Please tell her off. What's your name? Extina Bina. Hey you there. Please Hello. tell her off. Hey Katie. Um, I've been following you for a long time. You're the only one that Ugh, um, another suck ass. I follow, like actually follow surrounding this case. Um, that was I can't believe she said that stuff. This um, live and it's really irritating me because I love to like chime in. I never said anything bad. <laughs> like I'm so confused. What was your name? My name's Christina. I didn't meet her, and I was steady looking for Haley to try to. You're unmuted now. Thing. You're Thank unmuted. You. You're unmuted. I'm sorry about that. It's okay. No, you're Thank not. You. No problem. They do. They absolutely do good things for people. And Katie's up here acting like she worked for them, and now they're All a scam. Right. Like you're so full of shit. I don't know who these people are, so be nice. Okay. She just kicked that Christina girl out, and that was it. She didn't even say or do anything wrong. God, you're such a bitch. Oh, don't ask for a recap. She'll fucking block you. God. Who's this now? Crystal Hello, Rose Crystal. bought Hayden. Hello, Crystal. They're not saying anything. <laughs> Hello, Crystal. You are muted. All right. Um, trying to add this one, but she's not getting added. Okay. You're trying to add this one, but she's not getting added. Huh? I don't know who these people are. I'm scared. I'm adding people I don't know right now. You won't add me, though. Hello, Brit. Scaredy cat. That one kind of looks like oh, a... I'm so sorry. I did not mean to join. I'm trying to do something online. Oh, my... I'm so sorry. She's got oh, a hello. naked profile pic. Oh. Thank you, Jessica. <laughs> She's cute. You're yeah, she knows me. Everyone tap and try to get to 100. What, 100 yeah, we're not even towards 100. Um, who gives a shit? You don't deserve it. Do not like her fucking stuff, You're please. Box. Like me. <laughs> you tap in my box. Absolutely. Okay. Works. That's gross. Keep tapping my box. Pharma yeah, Pharma she's doing it purposely to be a pig. Exactly. She won't have people up that will say the truth. As soon as they start saying anything she don't like, drops. Just like that. Oh, someone up. Someone else is up. Some of these people, I don't know if they actually... Karma always say. wins. Anybody know that person? I do. Huh? Did hello, Carla? I'm here. Get her, please. I'm from where they're from, and I've met them. Okay. On many occasions, and Gypsy was great right. when all this stuff hit. Like in the end, this, this is somebody who knows time. Gypsy. She's gonna I get dropped. I believe that Dee Dee was guilty of. Was Karma always wins. Was her, her name? How to con? was ruining her in that way. Me too, love pink. That's what I want. I firmly believe that in the end, it was Gypsy's entire scheme, and she wanted to keep it that way because Dee Dee got sick, and Gypsy was caring for her. And then she discovered Absolutely, yeah. Men, Talking about some of them. She decided, I no longer want to be bald. Oh, good, balls. Keep encouraging. Ugly, so I no longer want to be ugly. Go I balls, no go balls, 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 balls. Because... <laughs> I want to walk to these men and I want to do all these things. Right? I would say and panel. Her mother needed Panel is appropriate, not box. And Katie knows she that. She's just being a disgusting pig. Gypsy didn't want to get away from any of that. She wanted to continue to scan. They have family members who, I mean, not family members, the neighbors had went in that house before. This girl, Karma Always Wins, is saying that. Like that. They're the house after the fact. That's when Dee Dee was bedridden. And she couldn't do everything. She's blaming she Gypsy for ev literally everything. Because Gypsy wanted a certain lifestyle. And she's proving that today. 
She still wants that lifestyle. She wants to be left alone, and she's tired of all this, and she's doing this one and that one, but she won't get off No, the I TV. never got into that. She won't get off the TV. Are you, from Louisiana, are you from Louisiana, or are you from Missouri? I'm born and raised in Louisiana. Okay. So you know, are you from the bayou? <gasps> I, I'm from 30 minutes from there. And that sounds rude to me. Are you from the bayou? What Katrina hit. Okay. No, she doesn't yeah, want to. She doesn't want to be left alone. She, no, Katie's got to put her mouth she, on because it. Because that would mean that she's not making any money. She's no longer capitalizing on her. Right. Didi's not innocent. She was guilty of having raising a child into that lifestyle. But all of the things, as far as they tag as abuse, Thank you. Gypsy needed all of those things. They could have let them go at some point. Like she, I believe you. Wheelchair. You're probably absolutely right. She continue to need it. She did need her feeding tube, but she didn't continue to need it. She needed all those medications, but it didn't continue. But they continued on with it to continue with the scam because if she had gotten better, absolutely that's what she'll do stuff wouldn't have kept increasing as far as are you okay <laughs> well but she didn't have cancer right like, there we go she, katie knows she everything did not have cancer that, that was a whole lot. thank you chicken Dee Dee wound chicken, up chicken. having cancer do you remember when Dee, Dee had cancer Dee, Dee died with cancer no she didn't she Here didn't have cancer when she died she had a hysterectomy there we go I thought that she still had it when she died. No. So Dee Dee died from a hysterectomy. That's what Katie's saying. What's she talking about? I'm not sure that is. No, Gypsy never had cancer. In any of her records. Thank you. No, I mean, Dee Dee had it when Gypsy was four. Oh. oh, yeah, maybe so. And then they said that all her documentation got lost during Katrina. That's also not true. Right. Everything. Everything where we're from, everything was done <laughs> in, in computer the computer systems. Like, I have literally, I work in healthcare. I have literally pulled her records, like, prior to her ever getting pulled out of, uh, put out of prison. I'm going to. Like, Thank you, because I'm curious happened. now. Like, I, I pulled her records and everything. Oh, don't say that. Don't say that. You can't say don't pulled say my records? Here because Christy watches. Don't that's very it. illegal. Uh, pull records? Barbara, that's very illegal to do, just saying, as a medical that. health person. If you're not treating her, you should okay, not thank you, pull Judy. any medical records. Oh, any way, shape, or form. Okay. Everyone, comment TikTok shop in the comments, please. Just Same, Frisco. Flag. That's the thing, though. That's what Katie does, and these fucking yeah, idiots might as well be up there licking your butthole and be like, like, "Okay, yeah, like dogs me, put everything up for me." Uh, well, I'm not scared of her. <laughs> I sound like a well, someone who's monkey. been in the medical world and who has been hurt. Oh, now this Ray doctor, Shadow, that's, that's this chick, y'all know and see. That you did that. Her. No, no right. To she is a so. know-it-all too. No right. Well, and that's a that's a huge HIPAA violation if she's in the healthcare and you know in the healthcare. Huge. Yeah. That is fucked up. Are you wanting to defend yourself or? I'm, I'm not going to defend it. I mean, I've done it. I know the violations, but I... And thank not you. Have... Sorry. Yeah. No, she just dropped her. This is I... why I don't trust the healthcare system, and I can be very mean. And when I'm nice to my uh, nursing staff, I give them candy, and I tell them I love them. No, I'm just not going to have, like, fucked. I know what Christy does, and I know how she responds, and she pays attention and nobody should be talking like that. Nobody should. Nobody should be. Only Katie can talk records. like that. Uh -oh. Only Katie can pull records, guys. Only Katie. People have pulled her records. Well, I'm, I'm I'd sure give her one, one and it, a half. I mean, let's face it. They are both um, know it alls. That's like going to be a huge we fight. We were still under. I think it was. At, I we bet were you under never. All the EMRs. I don't think she's a medical professional All the electronic um, medical records, like Epic and whatever else it is. No, they shouldn't be doing I it. I kicked her out. I kicked her out. I don't yeah. want anyone, like, gloating about mm. pulling up Gypsy's records. You can mm. hate Gypsy. But, but it's okay to have Dee Dee's records, KJ? No. someone's records. That is not your patient. No. She does call them staff. It's disgusting. And that was very unethical. 
very thank you for doing that because i was getting very upset about that being in the medical world for so long oh god that girl drives me nuts i cannot wait to use two fight it's gonna be hilarious i can't wait can't wait because it's gonna be it's gonna be bad so she will um, report her she does help the nurses. She keeps them. I think that a lot of people. Oh yeah, I understand because I got big time. Have typos. a lot of feelings about Gypsy and Dee Dee and. But it's okay for her to have Dee Dee's yes, records. Like, I don't know. Like, <sighs> I don't think Dee Dee was as neat as people pretend like she is. Because now she's picking on the neatness of her house. This is. Irrelevant, Katie. You're irrelevant. I'm sure the house Shut the fuck up. Honestly, I've anything. had it with her just talking time, about like, these people. You're obsessed. Dee Dee, go to bed. Me as the most. <laughs> um, now it's funny. You're laughing at a dead on woman. Top of things as you would be. If wow. she would have making she fun would of a dead a woman. I feel like people that con do it because they don't want to work. They want the easy way. What does it matter how neat she was? It matters because we were talking about how the house was hoarding. No, it doesn't matter. Okay. Yeah, the woman That's in the chat's matters. right. Did exactly. You, you should know, Katie, you considering your filth of a house. I can say whatever I want, Lily. This is my channel. This is my page. I'll say whatever I want. She got her bitch on. I'll talk about whatever I want. What a bitch. But don't pull up other people's medical records no only katie can do that only katie joy katie paulson can do that only kj can pull up records she could have been and blast them they say, simply because they got so many donations and like they there had to be a level of hoarding to a degree have you seen kj's house the filth yes. that they live in i mean gypsy is lazy as hell because her mom did everything for her but at the katie same could not time, possibly know that Dee was lazy too <laughs> she wearing her angry eyebrows on today. <laughs> I don't know. She never shows her face. She's a wimp. Have so many sheds and everything. Like it just—it was still a chock full. Have you seen Katie's garage? The hoarder yeah, that yeah, she I is. We're getting lots of donations. Lots of people in that area were doing fundraisers. You so told her to talk to me. Okay. Back. No, Katie doesn't know any of that. Just she just likes to talk like, and make herself feel um, important and make people believe that she actually knows everything. When in house, fact, she just doesn't. Um, Google knows more than Katie ever will. As far as clothing. Yes, it was a two bedroom house. It only had 11. It has like a thousand square feet. I guess it would depend on um, where being two doxed. Bedrooms. Like, say, if I doxed you, you'd have to contact no basement. Canada, like where I live. Not Figure out where I live and contact law enforcement near me. Whereas if Katie did it, you'd have to contact Wright County. Does anybody have in Minnesota. Anything, like, believe that Ken's actually speaking to Sir Morbid, or do you think it's going to be another one of those things? We do. To a, we do need to get to everyone to, to tell the truth. That's all I want. That's all I want. I want her no, to go with down. No, two bedrooms. Oh. With the truth. Set them against each other. This is boring. No, it was two bedrooms on bath. Regardless, it was two bedrooms on bath. She knows everything. About that. A thousand square feet. Who cares? Think of how small those bedrooms are. Think of how small each one of those rooms are. Yeah, and with uh, Dan, he needs to talk to him in um, room, Wright County. A dining room, a kitchen. Now she's a making bathroom, fun of how small Dee Dee's house was. And three bedrooms. It's not. That's a lot crammed into like a thousand square feet. Yeah, it's none of your fucking business. God, I hate that woman. Those bedrooms were small. Had to have been. Why do you ladies care? I hope both dance yeah, do. She docks know. both. Like 800, like almost 800 square feet uh, apartment. And um, it is pretty small in here. So I can only imagine that. What? Very small. Okay, I got my. The house um, was not free for them, by the way. Habitat for Humanity homes are not free. Oh my God. <laughs> my notifications are off. Free. They had two notes one for 63000 and one for 29000 I can you get off here actually in a minute. Whatever that is. Yeah, she knows the floor plan. Death. She knows she everything. For humanity, forty-eight thousand dollars. Yeah, she Almost said there was a lot of room. Are not free. Yeah. They were oh, well, that won't matter. I don't think Teresa. They moved more than it was worth. Initial. Yeah, it is a crime to dox in Minnesota. Absolutely. 
Katie, I have a question. So yeah. when now I don't know TikTok just told me that I need to take a break. <laughs> um, I do know that of course you have to go. It's a great job. You've gone live for ninety minutes. Don't forget to take a break. You know if, if I'll take a break in two minutes. Rush it along because they had come in after Katrina. Do you know how that came about at all? I, because I don't know. I the more I've learned about Habitat, the more of a scam I've learned. It yeah, is. I'm getting babysat. Yeah. It feels weird. I'm like, you know, I, I don't just, like that. I mean, I know, um, as a Katrina, Katrina, Katrina. So all right, I sounds good, Judy. I'm gonna get way. off of here anyways because. Um, I've had people enough were, of this girl. Were, I will post this on TikTok though for whoever, people that don't have. Um, really, really, oh my god, I'm an idiot! You know, I'll post this on YouTube for people who don't have TikTok. Just bringing out their hearts. Yeah, for, it's a scam, according to Katie. That's bull. And the more I thought about the Habitat house, she is. Look thought, what she did well, to Lindsay Chrisley. That was horrible. As got into it. Yeah, we do need to. All right, you guys have a great night. Thanks for hanging out with me. Like, okay, they lost And I'll post YouTube just just for other people who don't have this. Pretty sure that the Habitat project. Can take Bye. many, many months to get in.